Hello, this is Geotechland, and today I'll be taking a look at Plasma Big Screen, which is a Linux OS based on KDE that's designed to be used on your TV. And the big reason why I didn't want to make a video on this is that I think this might be the only distro that is designed to work on your TV, and not many people are really talking about you know the different OS is on on the TV right now you know there's many ways to view content on your TV a lot of people use their PS4 a lot of people use something like Roku or Apple and and there really isn't no alternative that's Linux based uh, and open source and so what KDE and their it looks like their teamwork with Mycroft what they're doing here is um pretty interesting so they do have this OS that's still very much in beta I actually was testing this device um, on my Raspberry Pi and overall there's some things that were working off the bat you know like once the OS is ready and boots up it lets me browse easily with my controller there was no issues getting that to work or I didn't have to set it up and I was browsing through the various apps and because it is a beta OS here I was really getting not the best experience with it I um, you know I connected it to my Wi-Fi and from then it kind of just froze and I just couldn't really get it to where it was stable enough for me to really use and really test out you know too much and let alone record me using it but I did just want to share with um, the community that this OS exists and I think um, you know we should support it because it really is the only OS of its kind and of course if there's other OS's in the works let me know in the comments below but anyways this OS it's based on KDE and I think the main developers of it right now is the the Mycroft team for those of you who don't know Mycroft but they've been working on an open source voice assistant you know to compete against you know Amazon's Alexa Apple's HomePod and so when I tried downloading the beta image um, let me go to their download here and it looks like it's through SourceForge but it looks like the last or the newest updated version of this is from March 26 so it was like five months ago so I get the impression that they don't really have that many people testing it or that many people using it so I just encourage everyone to try it out and you know test it out and you know fill out bug reports just to get this uh, OS up and running or there really isn't no other alternative besides you know proprietary software like you know like a PlayStation 4 or Apple or Roku and I, I think a lot of people are gonna really be using the you know an OS on their TV for watching movies even potentially even playing games down the road and it's gonna be something that people use for everything so it's important that we have an OS that's designed to work on the TV you know work with a remote and has an OS that makes sense for the TV but let me know what you think. Do you think a Linux-based TV OS is something that should be a priority? What do you use to browse, you know, apps like YouTube or Netflix? Do you use something like a, a PS4? Do you use, do you just hook it up to your PC? Let me know in the comments below and thank you for watching. If you like this video, don't forget to like, share, subscribe, and I will see you all next time.